Welcome back to 2230. Today, we dive into the latest updates on the trial of Lim Teen, a prominent Singaporean lawyer and leader of the People's Voice Party. Lim faces charges of practicing law without a valid practicing certificate, among other legal issues. As we explore the recent trial developments, don't forget to hit the like button, share your thoughts in the comments, and subscribe for more in-depth analyses. In the recent trial session, Lim Teen's defense counsel, Patrick Fernandez, announced their intention to file a no-case-to-answer motion. This strategic move suggests a belief that the prosecution's evidence might not be sufficient to substantiate the charges against Lim. Fernandez argued that the evidence notes presented by the prosecution were initially deemed incomplete but later found to be comprehensive after some missing pages related to military court trials were added. One significant point of contention revolves around the alleged lack of a first information report and the correspondence between the Supreme Court Registrar and the Attorney General's chambers. Lim Teen, through Fernandez, expressed skepticism about being singled out for prosecution and emphasized the importance of accessing this correspondence to establish the truth. Lim's defense team, led by Fernandez, sought access to the correspondence between the Supreme Court Registrar and the AGC, believing it crucial for Lim's defense. The prosecution, represented by Deputy Public Prosecutor Edwin So, refused, citing the sensitive nature of official communications between agencies and internal government procedures. So emphasized that the focus should be on Lim's specific charges rather than broad inquiries into other cases. Fernandez warned of filing a criminal motion with the High Court if the prosecution continued to withhold this correspondence. The judge granted a five-week adjournment for the defense to file submissions and an additional two weeks for both parties to submit reply submissions. Lim Teen expressed dissatisfaction via Facebook with the prosecution's refusal to disclose the correspondence. He described the prosecution's stance as outrageous and highlighted his lawyer's efforts to protect his legal rights by seeking access to the withheld documents. Lim Teen faces a total of seven charges, including practicing law without a valid certificate, criminal breach of trust, and stalking. The charges span multiple years, with allegations of misappropriating funds and engaging in improper conduct. Lim's defense emphasizes procedural guidance from the Law Society and asserts that he kept the court informed about the pending status of his practicing certificate application. As Lim Teen's trial unfolds, the legal intricacies and procedural disputes take center stage. The defense's motion to dismiss, coupled with the prosecution's withholding of crucial correspondence, adds layers of complexity to this legal saga. Stay tuned for more updates, and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to 2230 for comprehensive coverage of Asian news and politics. What are your thoughts on this legal drama? Share them in the comments below.